Welcome back to High Noon Racing, y'all. And do I ever have a video for you? How the heck are y'all doing today? Good. I'm gonna hit you with this unscripted off the rip. We installing waste case or whatever's in this box. It's in the box. Well, obviously you can't know. <laughs> I have to choose the mystery box. No, <laughs> no, I'm not happy with that, but you have to choose the mystery box. Oh God, all right. I'm a gambling you, you, you know, you just made life miserable. Did I? You might have. I can always go home. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I changed my answer. <laughs> you changed your answer? <laughs> Instantly, huh? Uh, you don't like that. I don't like, like that. Like that. You know what that is. It looks like an amp wiring kit, right? I, I didn't come over here to work on the truck. Mm, yeah, I know. <laughs> CCA, huh? Yeah, copper clad aluminum. UFC is the way to go on audio. Remember All right, that? well, we're not running sundown audio around these parts. What do you run? Incriminator. Woo, incriminator. <laughs> that tape's no joke there. A buddy of mine gave that to me for changing the belt on his side by side. Jesus Christ. Yeah, it's like seven mil thick. And or 10 mil, I'm sorry. No, 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 come on. <laughs> Alright, we'll do the waste gates. Maybe that one next time. <laughs> I really don't feel like getting all those panels off and diving in and around stuff in the truck, so. We'll just do waste gates. We gotta figure out, go online real quick, figure out what those springs equal, because I forgot. They got paint on them. And then um, we'll do some mass. Simple addition. Put them in there and uh, put them on the car. Alright. Red is four, green is six, yellow is seven, natural color spring in the unit is six. Uh, we're gonna have to write that down. So the whole time? No, but it'll be there for my. You're gonna make me forget stuff. Six. Four. Do you you burn me with that? You already ripped my hair off. And then there's six in there. We'll just put six over here. So what's all that added up? Because we need to get. Don't matter how many waste gates you got, whatever your spring pressure is, that's what your waste gate spring pressure overall will be. So if you have two waste gates and you got 14 pounds of spring, that does not equal 29. That's going to equal, it's 14, 14, 29? It doesn't equal 28. It's just going to equal 14. So all of those together is 20. I need you to use your outside voice. <coughs> yeah, thank you. So that should be 23 if you do all four springs. 23? All right. Then we'll put 23 pounds of spring in there. Ah, so these come with two six pound springs in them, which equals 12. We don't want to go to 24 or whatever the number was, 23. We actually want to go to like 18. So what is that? It's a sixer. That's a sixer? You just add 12 and six and get 18? Yes. Is it in a groove? It is. It sure is. Look at that. So that's all we got to do. Clamp her back down and be good to go. It'll be at 18. Oh, I go for it, Chuck. Yeah. Push that thing, dude. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not shaking for any reason in particular. <laughs> I can't get it. 
your hands in the way. <laughs> <laughs> hang on, hang on. Move your hand. <laughs> oh, yeah. Get that one one more. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I felt like more than 18 pounds of force. <laughs> I guess for 18 pounds of uh, pressure, wastegate wise, that's what it'll equal. I ain't gonna bore hog these down. You pretty much just snug them and give them just a slight bit of movement after. Yeah, don't use the impact like Josh likes to. <laughs> It's set so low. Some kind of grease inside that container you were putting these in. Yeah, that'll help them screws go in, you know. Help me drop them on the floor. Maybe you shouldn't have greasy hands. Well, I didn't until I took Look them at them nails, dog. You gonna trim them cokers? swap out these side one of these sides plug that top hole because we got a top hole we're gonna put one of these guys in and that's eighth inch NPT I believe no what is that I don't know I forgot I think it's eighth inch that looks bigger than an eighth inch though right? sure do right, so now we're gonna pop out these side ones because we're going to get another port in there and plug the top off so when we're putting dome pressure on it don't just leak out that big hole right there and that's for our boost reference to go so the reference off the intake is going to start lifting the plunger the dome pressure based on what the computer's controlling is going to try and push back on it and it's important to have that because if you don't have that it'll still work but your system's going to be operating like junk and it's definitely not the way to go you're basically running off all back pressure at that point Nice gouge in my brand new wastegate. That's right. Chicks dig. Chicks dig scars, right? We're in the game. We're in the game. And what scratch, dude? Yeah. We good? What scratch? Look, brand new. DS Racing, don't be getting no ideas from us now. We in, we in the game? We in the game. Look at that. Oh, these are not tight, so we should probably tighten the other ones. <laughs> Good to know. You like them? Dude, bubbles, like, goggles. Goggles, dude. Oh, scientific now. Yeah. Dude. Oh, oh, they flip up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hell so, yeah. So, what'd you say? <laughs> you turn around and flip them up, huh? <laughs> talking to me? Help me, boys. Help me. Tangled up. Ricky. Julian. Help me. I'm all tangled up in this wire. Look in this wire. Help me. Don't get freaking gun in the tires. I told him to be careful, and the first thing he does, he runs her into the mud. Sitting there just gunning it, spinning the fing tires in the mud. Julian. It's greasy. Greasy. They're out there in the garage doing real greasy stuff. Oh, that's greasy. That's really greasy. Yeah, that's greasy. Greasy. Alright y'all, so where are we at with scoots? Last y'all saw we had four injectors that were not wanting to 
do anything at all. We tried everything under the sun, couldn't get them to work. This last Wednesday, I mailed them back to Snake Eater Performance, so they say five to seven days they're back at your door. We got a holiday Monday, so we'll say six to eight, eight, eight days. And uh, yeah, when they get back, that should be it. Fire up scoots, start doing head rat stuff. We got our waist skates all ready to go. We're uh, we're in good shape. So hopefully the next video y'all see will be doing hood rat stuff. All right, guys. Until next time, I'll catch you in the next one. Have a great weekend. And if you're new here and you like these types of videos, make sure to subscribe and hit the thumbs up button because it helps the video get seen by other cool people like you.